Well, if you've ever seen Breaking Bad, I'm sure the RV, the crystal ship, will be quite familiar to you. Greenlight did produce this in the 164 scale, and later on they came out with the 143 scale, which kind of blows away the little 164 scale. It swallows it entirely. I've been wanting one of these for a while, but I wasn't willing to pay the $40 that they were going for when they first came out, at least to get one shipped, and they never did come out of my stores, unfortunately. So, some guy was selling them on eBay, had them for 10 bucks plus a few dollars shipping, and I managed to bid on one, and no one else outbid me, and I got it for cheap. Package is damaged pretty good, but hey, I'm not going to complain for 10 bucks plus ship. That thing is incredibly... <laughs> large. Oh, that's funny. Gotta crack this thing open. Compare the sizes. Oh, jeez. It's broken up pretty good. I did not realize that the plastic was smashed as well. Well, that was fun taking out. It's a good thing I was planning on opening this. Because the eBay seller did not say anything about it being damaged. That has some weight to it. Jeez. I love that you can see the lab inside. If I get really adventurous, maybe one day I'll put some curtains inside there to match the original. 143 scale. Interesting, this one's not numbered. At least I don't see a number. Might be the first green light that I've got. That's like the run didn't actually have a serial number on there. I do you think it's pretty cool to have a Breaking Bad logo right there? Fleetwood Bounder. Nice little detailed exhaust. Too cool. <laughs> Even has the different mirrors. But this one doesn't have the hanging clothes like the 164 does. Ah, there's no bullet holes? Really? They only put the bullet holes on the chases. And I almost wonder if they did it for the Green Machine too. GRT 600. See the lab inside, that's awesome. I love it. Too bad the door doesn't open. It's not really a green lights thing though to have opening doors. Oh snap. Do a sized comparison. Look at that. I want to see four could easily fit inside that thing. This is amazing. They're pretty much the same. Well, I'm guessing what they probably did is obviously use the same. Hello. Use the same rendering on the computer to make both. Because they are. Ooh, that window pushed in. Well, they're pretty much identical, but. Hmm. It's interesting they want the brown interior on this one, but. Black on this one, but. Okay, I can see it now. This one, the lines are a lot more obvious on the 164, but the 143, a lot harder to tell. But they're there. And this one doesn't have the steps on the side. Yeah, pretty much identical. Just shrunk down. It even has like the same bulb style. That is very cool. Deck on though, that is heavy. Not sure how I'm going to display that one yet. Wait, you guys say display them together, side by side. What I need to do is I need to get the Breaking Bad 164 version of the van RV. 
so that way they can be identical. So I'm assuming, I haven't taken mine apart because I've got the green machine, I'm not going to crack that one open, at least not yet, I might have to because my package got damaged, but um, I wouldn't mind having a regular version to crack open to put them side by side. Because like I found this one at Toys R Us when they first came out, and I was able to snatch that up, but I never did get the, the regular Breaking Bad. Again, this is something that didn't really come out of my area, unfortunately. But anyways, guys, let me know if you've got one. And let me know if you got the green machine of this one. The green machine for the 164, they just did the green wheels and green chassis. But for the 143 scale, everything that you see, this beige color, is green. I never did try chasing it down because I didn't really care for how the orange and the yellow orange kind of clashed with the green. It just kind of made it look really weird. So I stayed away from it. But definitely happy to have the regular version. In my opinion, it looks way better than the green machine. But anyways, guys, let me know if you got one. And as always, happy hunting.